In this program, we're going to learn about friction. What is friction? Friction is a force that makes moving objects slow or stop. Friction holds back the movement of a sliding object. Friction is the force that makes these girls slow down when coming down a slide. Friction acts in the opposite direction to the way an object wants to slide. Friction occurs between all moving objects. Friction will eventually stop a ball from rolling. If it weren't for friction, the ball would roll forever. When a car needs to stop, it's the friction between the brakes and wheels that causes the car to slow down and stop moving. Friction is the result of tiny particles called molecules in both objects being attracted to each other. When two objects are pushed together harder, like this brake and tire, there is more friction. Friction causes a change in motion. Friction causes a change in energy, too. The energy in any moving object is called mechanical energy. Water that moves has mechanical energy. When you ride your bike, you use mechanical energy, too. Friction changes mechanical energy into heat energy. Rubbing sticks together is mechanical energy. The friction changes the mechanical energy to heat energy. When a person strikes a match, the motion of the match, which is mechanical energy, is converted to heat energy because of friction. That's why you rub your hands together to get warm. The mechanical energy of moving your hands is converted to heat energy because of friction. Sometimes we need to reduce friction. One way to reduce friction is by rolling. Wheels roll and reduce friction between an object and the ground so that objects move more easily. Another way to reduce friction is to use a lubricant, like oil or grease. Water on a water slide acts as a lubricant, too. It creates a film between your body and the slide. Another way to reduce friction is with less surface area. A thin blade on ice skates allows for little friction between the skate and the ice. Without friction, we wouldn't be able to walk, or use a mouse, or sit in a chair. Everybody and everything would just slip and fall. Friction affects just about everything we do. Now that you better understand friction, think about this. Why is smoke coming from the spinning tires? Think about it. 